Hello gamers, welcome back to another Dead by Daylight video. Well, the first one in a long time, I should really say. I have since privated all of those old Dead by Daylight videos I uploaded, because as you can see, I am red ranks now, and I have improved a lot. In this first video back today, we are going to be playing some Legion. And now before we get started, I am going to go over my preferred perk build right now with Legion. I am still working on getting Undying with Blight. I'm not quite there yet, as you can see. I'm only level 33. But once I get him... Well, let's look at the build right now. So we have Barbecue and Chili, Corrupt Intervention, Discordance, and Ruin. So I obviously have barbecue and chili just so I can try and see where everybody is and just have some more awareness of where all the survivors are. Then we have corrupt intervention to help me get started early game and, you know, punish me less for messing up my feral frenzy, which I do tend to do sometimes. And then we have discordance to let me know when two people are on the same generator. That's usually a good opportunity to get a decent frenzy chain when there are two people that close together. And then we have Ruin, obviously, to help counter gen speed and keep everything slowed down. Now, in the future, when I get Undying, I will probably end up getting rid of Corrupt. That will probably end up getting replaced. Yeah, but that's my build for now. And my add-ons vary wildly depending on what I have available. I usually use the mural sketch, but I don't have very many, so I am using up my mischief lists. And my second add-on... I'll change the order. My second add-on could really be anything. It could be Frank's mixtape or Filthy Blade. It could be Joey's mixtape or Julie's mixtape. I tend to use either of those. I do not use detect detection range add-ons because what's the point of having extra range if you can't get to the survivor that it's showing you? If anything, I want less detection range so I know who's immediately closer to me. I will sometimes run etched ruler, in fact that's what I'm going to do now. I will use legion pin sometimes if I'm feeling up for it, but I do not always do that. Yeah, and that's my build. Let's go ahead and get into a match. Here we are in the match. We are on Fractured Cowshed, which is a map I actually get a lot as Legion. Now, I don't actually know how clear my voice is. I turned down my game audio as much as I felt comfortable doing, so I so that my voice had a better chance of being heard. And it looks like someone spawned in the same side of the map as me. Let's see what we can do. This guy's closer. That was a very stupid play. I, my, I just kind of did that on instinct. I did not mean to do that. Oh, good, really good job, Ash. That might cost him. Oh, oh there's somebody here. There goes my ruin, two seconds into the match. Da 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 da. Do I get her? I mean, it doesn't really matter. She's already injured. Yeah, but it looks like all the survivors spawned not actually on my corrupted gens. They all spawned right next to me, which... Okay, did she think she was gonna finish the heal? Do you know killers can one, Shane? Well, that was free. that's a free hook before Jen's pop. 
Ash is just running around cleansing totems. I really don't know what he's doing here. Ash? His basement here? Oh, Ash. Dude! Bro. Come on, man. What was that? This is really far away from your team, dude. I don't know if this was the play. A hook in the basement before Jens popped. And now they're healing. Oh no, that was the Jane. And her med kit. Stuck on nothing. That's the gen in the cow shed. Right? No, that's that one. This is the gen next to the cow shed. I know which gen this is. Looks like I stop it. I don't know what happened there, if I'm going to be fully honest with you guys. I do not know what- that was not the play. I honestly don't know what happened there. She is going for the basement, it looks like. Yeah, she's going for the sash. She gets to him, but... Are you the only person? He has DS. Oh no, there is no DS. Well, Ash, hate to break it to you, man. But you are in a bad spot. Where'd that Nia go run off? Scass. Blech. Where'd that Nia run off to? Oh, she stayed. For some reason. I heard the Nia, yeah. I, there was a Nia here. I swear there. She might have had on. That would make sense for Jane. Aren't you on second hook? This Ash is dead. You're on second hook. This is not going too well for your team, guys. Okay, if we're playing at Shaq, getting rid of that's gonna be really good. Is she gonna... Yep. Nice movement. Nope. I'm just gonna kill this poor Ash. That knee is healing for some reason. Okay, she ran off. Yeah, that was not the play. They have two people dead now. And generators seem to they seem to think that'll do anything. I don't know how y'all expect to pull this back. There's blood. Iron will? Because I see blood but no scratch marks. Iron will. Seems like. Let's check over here. I heard something. I swear to god I just heard her for like a second. I can't afford to keep looking for her though. Okay, who's left? Nia and Nia. Two Nias. Oh yeah! One of them's got that yellow suit. With the goggles. Okay, the, one of them's healing. The other one's insta throwing pallets.
Oh, she got stuck. Yeah, but Dead Heart will save you as per usual. These are all safe pallets. And there's no shack pallet either. I don't know where she thinks she's gonna go. But spinning me isn't really gonna... Is that auto- I think that auto-aim literally just actually helped me out there. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna put her in the basement. She's on first hook. And I want this other Nia to come save her. Because this is in the middle. Yeah, so I don't get anything on barbecue. I used to run whispers on Legion. But I don't anymore. And I'm really starting to think that maybe I should put it back on, because this happens a lot. Let me see. Hmm. Good, good, that's what I want. I went this way, of course. It looks like they split up. <laughs> she thought I wouldn't see her. I almost missed her though too, so she has a point. Oh, I'm giving her the fast fall. Let's. Oh, never mind. She reacted very poorly to that, and had to drop the pallet. Well, if she hadn't done that. Okay, crow. She's yeah at this loop now. No, I thought she wasn't gonna insta throw pa the pallets like her other friend. This Nia's on her first hook, too. Are there any more pallets over here? There's this one. But I can't get her here. No. Dang it. The other one is doing a generator. Yes. I don't know what to do here. Ooh. So yeah, this Nia is also on her first hook, so I might be able to bait out the other one. Oh, she's right there. And she's got a pallet, but I have her. No, I don't. Oh, that wasn't the Plania. I get you now. Uh, that basement really, really messed them up. Those basement hooks really screwed them up. That was nice. That did not quite go how I expected. Oh, I didn't get, like, any... Oh my god, am I gonna pip at all? I might, let's see. Wow, I did! So guys, that is gonna do it for this gameplay video. Thank you so much for watching. And if you like, if you like, if you if you like my playstyle, if you think I might be interesting, please do consider sticking around. I am trying to grow as a Dead by Daylight YouTuber, and maybe in a couple years, I'll be able to be a bigger name. That would truly be that would truly be wonderful. Thank you so much for sticking around, and I'll see you all later. Toodles.